This soul singer has started taking chances with her music and her style by adding more of her Jamaican heritage to the mix. Where you come to feel Hi, I'm Rebecca Brayton and welcome to WatchMojo.com and today we're speaking with Kreisha Turner about fashion. Now I know fashion is very important to you, so why don't you tell us a bit about your approach to style? For me, fashion is definitely one of my favorite parts of the other side of the industry. I'm aware of trends and I take some of those trends, but I never... I guess convert to the trend, I convert the trend to my style in a sense. I'm very, very particular about the things that I wear and the things that I like to wear. And you know, half the time I'll go shopping and never come home with anything because I'm so specific in the things that I want, the things that I see in my head. I just have to feel good in it. You know, you have the different days and the, and the stage and the club and all that kind of stuff. I just enjoy going out and, and finding something to wear in general. What about the fashion in your videos? How much say do you have about the wardrobe? The sound and the visual have to go together hand in hand. So because, you know, it's my sound, you know, the same thing with, with the outfits. So I got to send out requests to certain designers, so in the music videos, you know, from Rock Paper Scissors, I'm wearing uh, Canadian designers, Greta Constantine and Carly Wong, and then I could stay. I'm wearing this fabulous turquoise bodysuit by Angel Brinks, I and mean, I'm actually wearing her right now, too. I also have this one lady who sends me all my jewelry, um, Miss Beleza jewelry, and everything you see, and I could say I'm wearing some fabulous necklaces, most intricate things, and she hand makes them all. I'm blessed to have people who, who believe in me, and, and are willing to, you know, lend me some amazing clothing. Now, we obviously have to talk about the statement piece, which is your hairstyle. So why don't you tell us why you decided to make that change? It was kind of funny. The other day, my mom was teasing me. She's like, you know, everything seems to be coming just full circle because I used to wear my hair like this all the time. Um, back when I was on the underground scene, this is how I rocked my hair. I think as a curly haired girl, all of us go through that straight phase where we're like, oh, we want straight hair, but I don't know, this, uh, the last couple years I've been wearing my hair natural again and I absolutely love it. I noticed that a lot of, you know, the ethnic women that are in the limelight right now, like none of them wear their hair natural. And I was like, you know, it kind of sends a bad message to, you know, all the kids with the curly hair or kinky hair. And um, so I decided to go back to my roots sonically with my music and literally with my hair. And, um, you know, I also wanted to send the message that, you know, curly hair is beautiful. Rock it the way God made it. <laughs> awesome. Thank you very much. Thank you.